What's up, it's Sports Ball 27. Today, we're going to be talking about UFC 117, the aftermath, everything that happened after the fight, Chael, Son- Chael Sonnen's comments after being on EA Sports, and um, after being on uh, ESPN MMA Live, and after um, talking uh, to HDNet Fight's uh, interview, and his comments, and Anderson Silva's next fight, and Vitor Belfort's comments on the Che Sonnen fight. All that and way more coming up. You're watching Sports Ball. Sports topics, sports information, sports news, you can get it all here, plus way more. What's up, it's Sports Ball 27, got my own logo, got my own new stream show. Uh, I'm sort of big. Uh, today I'm going to be talking about UFC 117, the aftermath, everything that happened after the fight, every... every Fighters' comments and uh, Chael Sonnen on EA uh, on ESPN MMA Live. Um, this uh, Vitor Belf. Well, first of all, Chael backed up everything he said. That's what I thought. He deserved to win, and uh, uh, he just got unlucky. And well, I don't, I don't think he deserves an immediate rematch. But oh well, yeah, he does. He does. What am I thinking? I'm stupid. What am I thinking about that? Okay. Um, these are some of the fighters' comments. Uh, Bella, Fort, B. Tor Belfort says, not waiting for Silva, calls Ed Sore is a clown. And he says, I'll fight, and I'll fight Anderson next. And, uh, Chael Soden, when he tar- tied to Mike Starka of, uh, HGNet Fights in an interview about how emotional it, it is and, he says he's ready to cry, uh, cry right this second because he said that he spent 20 uh, pure years training for this day and training for that day, and I basically had it. I had, I was the champ. I was gonna be the champion. Then I lost it. And uh, he calls the UFC middleweight division a locker room of cowards that don't want to fight Anderson Silva. And then he says, if you are in the UFC to fight for the title, then why are you in the UFC? Um, Che also didn't, he may speak mean things, but he speaks the truth. That's the main thing, he speaks the truth. And uh, that's all he does, he speaks the truth. And I like him for that. Okay. His comments on uh, when he was on ESPN MMA Live. Chael Sonnen revealed these things about the fight and some things Anderson Silva said when he was on the bottom of Chael Sonnen. He said Anderson Silva gave up and told Chael that he gave up near the end of the third round himself. Chael told Anderson he would put an end to the punishment if Anderson just rolls over and gives Chael the choke. Anderson Silva, before the fight, had promised Antonio Rogerio and O'Gara Minotaro that he was going to win the fight by submission. And once when Chael says... Give give up your back and uh, give the choke. Anderson Silva turns it down. No, Chael admitted that. Chael also speaks the truth and he admits things. He said, uh, Chael admitted that everything Anderson hit him with hurt, and he said he was a boxer as a kid and hasn't told anybody about it. He talked to his dad as a kid and wanted to quit wrestling, be- and become an amateur boxer uh, and box in the Olympics. Well, now I know why Chael really wasn't that scared of Anderson's stand-up, but when asked what ne- what's next for Chael, he said, well, you know I'll tell you if Bisping ever addresses me in public again. I'll bury him where he stands. And Chael Sohn in another classic uh, trash talk comment, I think he does deserve the immediate rematch. I think he definitely does deserve it. Uh, he had the fight in the bag. Uh, Anderson Silva said that he gave up. I believe that because Anderson Silva looked like he really wanted to give up. Um, it was Chael Sonnen's fight. He is the true UFC middleweight champion. Uh, I believe that with all my heart. And I don't think Anderson Silva is as good as we thought he was. And I think Chael is better than we thought he was. Um, my next video, I'm going to talk about UFC 118. I got some uh, BJ Penn interview with Fightline.com. Thanks again, Fightline.com, for giving me this information. And uh, it will be pretty. It will be uh, pretty good in James Tony and Couture's uh, back-to-back comments. 
If you want to hear more about my comments or MMA, you can go to jfireson.blogspot.com or search SportsWall27 on Ustream. Sports Hour. Watch it.